my channel so today's video is going to be a first impressions and I will be showing you how I use the Eyler London Dye Brow Kit. This is a DIY eyebrow tinting kit that you can use at home. It's meant to be super easy, under 15 minutes of application and this box contains up to 12 applications so it's really a steal of a deal. I picked this up from Boots for £7.50. If you are in the UK you can get this from Boots or Amazon. If you are in the US you can find this on Amazon.com. So the box contains three items. You have the actual dye and I picked this up in black. You can also get a dark brown colour and then there's the activator. And you have this really tiny little wand that you can use to apply the product to your eyebrows. It also contains really handy instructions and I would recommend you always read this and do a patch test before you actually apply this product just to make sure you don't have any allergies to the product itself. So the second thing the instructions state to do after doing your patch test would be to thoroughly clean your eyebrows. So I will be using the simple micellar cleansing water as well as a little bit of a cotton pad and I'm just going to wipe away any grease or debris. So once you've cleaned your eyebrows, you just want to make sure that it's thoroughly dried before you apply any product. So now that my eyebrows are completely dry, I'm just going to go ahead and apply some petroleum jelly just above and below my eyebrow just to protect the skin to make sure no dye gets on that area. So the instructions recommend that you just work on one eyebrow at a time. So I've only applied the petroleum jelly above and below this eyebrow and I'm just going to start by mixing the product together. So this is the colour cream in black. I'm just going to pierce the top of this and apply about two centimetres of this into the mixing bowl. So, and I'm just going to cover that straight away. After that, I'm going to add five drops of the activator to the colour cream. And it just meant to mix this really well and I'm just using a bobby pin to mix this together. Um, it's just easier that way. So just mix until it forms a really good creamy consistency and there's no drip. Okay, I don't think that's dripping anywhere so I think we've formed our cream consistency. I'm just going to use a mascara wand that comes with the kit to apply this to the eyebrow. So just make sure that you apply this with your eye closed um, so you avoid getting this into your eye. So I'm just going to close my right eye and I think that's why they recommend to just work on one eye at a time and I'm just going to apply this nicely to the brow. As you can see that was really easy to apply to my right eyebrow. I'm just going to let this sit for 10 minutes and then I'm just going to remove it with a cotton swab. So I must say there is a bit of a tingly feeling. I can feel that there's something on my eyebrow. It kind of feels like tea tree oil. I don't know if you've tried tea tree oil when it has that bit of a tingle especially you apply it to your scalp. Um, it feels like that. So 10 minutes is up, it's time to take this off. So I'm just using a slightly damp cotton pad. This has on the same micellar water and I'm just going to use upward strokes to remove the product. So this is the final result of the right eyebrow where I've applied the product. The left eyebrow I still have to do. Do you guys see much of a difference? I am trying to see. I mean, my right eyebrow looks slightly thicker, I guess, um, because of the dye, but in terms of colour, it's very subtle. Um, comment below if you guys see a difference. Do you guys think there's a difference? This one is where I've applied the dye, and this one doesn't have any dye. What do you guys think? Let me know. Can you see a difference? I'm going to try to zoom in so you guys can see, and I'll take some pictures as well. So let's go ahead and apply the product to the left eyebrow so I can show you guys the final results. So now it's time to remove the product from my left eyebrow so we can compare and see the final results. So guys, these are the final results after I've used the Eyler London Dye Brow Kit to tint my eyebrows black. I definitely can see a difference with the left eyebrow because it looks darker. It isn't as dark as the right eyebrow for some reason. And I was thinking perhaps maybe some of the petroleum jelly got caught on the hairs on this eyebrow and that affected the penetration of the product. Not sure, but I would recommend just be sure that you're careful when you're applying petroleum jelly 
and just apply it to the skin above and below the brow making sure you're not getting any of the eyebrow hairs caught so I'm sure you guys are wondering would I purchase this product again I definitely would use it again and purchase it I think it's a really easy application as well as a really simple way to get your eyebrows tinted at home especially as we are in lockdown now and salons are closed if you want an option to do your eyebrows at home I would recommend this um, just be sure that when you're using it you avoid the eyes keep your eyes closed you don't want to get this into your eyes and work on one eyebrow at a time let me know if you can see a difference would you try this or have you tried this at home and did it work for you let's get chatting just down below and thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up and share this video as well because some people may be looking for a really easy way to dye their eyebrows at home so i'll see you guys in the next video bye